This cable's obviously a little damaged, but for what it's worth, you're simply just going to take the cable, insert it through the top hole in this bracket here, and then put the Zerk fitting into the hole. Be a little easier with the pliers. After we've got that in there, it's more or less just going to slide right through the hole and snap into place. Okay. Like I said, this cable is a little damaged, but for what it's worth, if you were to need to remove it, there's just these two little tabs in which you can compress. Essentially, it's just going to slide its way out the rear.